So good morning guys, uh, it's just a touch before 8 a.m. here on a beautiful Friday. We're removing this baby beech tree here because this red oak's coming down. So we're going to work on this red oak as much as we can, uh, see how far we get. We got the whole Petzl set up here today. It's the um, 2014 edition of the zigzag along with the chicane. Just a great setup guys. A lot of people ask me about it. And it's, can't go wrong with it. A big critique would be like it's long profile, rigid, long profile. But you could say that about the rope runner, bro. It's uh
That looks terrible up there. Twisted lines. Alright. Well, other than our twisted up lines, I think we could get a bunch of this work done. Uh, pretty fast. Ideally. It will be fast. Alright. Cool. Let's do this. Oh yeah, and we for sure got a full gear set up over here. Brought up the rings and everything. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So this right here is not the best, but <clears throat> it's definitely workable, you know? One of those kind of things you Sometimes you just compromise. Uh, so this usually happens when you're in a great big rush and maybe you gotta get to school at like 11.40 and you decided to take on a job like early in the morning, right before school, knowing that you got like a 19, a 19 page reading to do by uh, Philosophical author, yeah, you know, like just hypothetically speaking, you know, uh, yeah, that's what happens when you hypothetically have to do all that kind of stuff, and then you know, uh, yeah, yeah, you get me, get what I'm follow what I'm trying to say, you see what I'm spraying. Okay. I gave Justin a GoPro, so hopefully uh, the footage he's got is coming out really good. Rope.
All right, so here we go. Right here. Oh, that's pure. that's just perfect, man. What a nice knot there. Oh yeah, give it up for Justin down there. He's a firefighter um, here in our town. Uh, uh. Yep. Okay, actually, maybe what I want to do instead, I'm beginning to realize what the heck I'm doing here. Not a good idea. What I'll do instead is this. All right. It's a long branch. All right. All right, brother. Here he goes. Actually, this branch is going to get in the way. Side loading the zigzag when it's on uh, a DRT system, MRS, uh, when you're using it in a different way. It's a, uh, you know what I mean? Uh, I guess what I'm trying to get at is if you're worried about like the whole side load and the profile of the thing, 
uh, versus the Rope Runner Pro. It's really, it almost just doesn't even matter. Seriously. to keep that fence intact and uh just gonna see what I can do as far as um our drop zone down there from a base tie SRS anchor to a um, an MRS system here real soon so I guess we could keep that on there actually no this rope is plenty long for this tree in an MRS system so we'll keep it on there I keep it on all right this guy's gonna come over here. Just gonna clip it on real quick. Cool. Gonna take off this chicane. Right. Close that up. gonna set up a rigging point so now the rigging point uh, I want everything to come over here into this side so what I'll do is I'll run the rope along the back side of here give it some compression we'll tie it right up there and we'll redirect it right around that branch let me do that real quick <laughs> all right Yeah, once you're working high up in the canopy, I mean, adding compression, doing all these other things, you know, thinking about vectors and stuff like that, whenever you're doing high risk stuff, especially, it's just, um, the time to really, um, dive into those, into your knowledge base. Yeah. Ah, okay. Whatever 
whatever that's worth. Okay. Beautiful. All right. Rigging point's gonna be right up there. Tying point's gonna be right here. Okay. Here goes a secret weapon, uh, which you guys should be pretty familiar with. Alright, cool. We'll keep this nice and straight that way. Don't create any obstacles when it gets caught in a crotch or something. Bit pull out nice and easy. Very good. And here goes that. And I didn't bring an extra carabiner. Hold on. This is one of my new favorite carabiners. <laughs> Wire gate. Okay, good. Well, show you guys a little function test. Make sure this is running correctly. Um, that's a little weird. Get that out of the way. vertically up through the canopy and if I were to cut it from down there it's just gonna lay down on the rest of those trees and it's just gonna be a pain in the butt so what I'm gonna do is tip tight here and it's just gonna fall butt first onto the ground
does a good old Johnny kick. 